news we've been following since this morning. Right now, Texas EquiSearch crews are looking for a missing University of Houston student who happens to be the son of a U.S. congressman. Carl Conyers was last seen Tuesday in the area of Southmore Boulevard and Scott Street in Southeast Houston. Channel 2's Brandon Walker spoke with Conyers' mother as she arrived in Houston a few hours ago. And Lauren Monica Conyers says she last spoke to her son on Tuesday. They laughed, they talked, they joked. And so that's why word of his disappearance, she says, just doesn't seem right. I don't go a day without talking to my son. Monica Conyers scrolled through pictures on her phone from the last time she saw her son. May the good Lord bless you. Here in Houston earlier this month for his 21st birthday. Carl Conyers has been missing since Tuesday. Unlike him, his mom says, to be out of touch. It's just strange that all of his stuff is still in the apartment. His keys, his phone, the car, his clothes, his wallet, his bank cards. Conyers is the son of Michigan Congressman John Conyers. At his apartment, not far from the U of H campus, HPD, the FBI, Texas EquiSearch searched for anything that might offer clues of his whereabouts. Conyers' roommate says he last saw him Tuesday. He says Conyers seemed weird and shaved off his well-known beard. He was cooking and um, I greeted him. I noticed he was hiding his face a little bit. I didn't think too much of it. Well, I find it strange that Carl cut his off. Monica Conyers isn't sure the significance of the beard being gone. She says she has heard from his roommate since his disappearance, but so far what they've told her hasn't been much help. It's just been conflicting stories, so I don't, I, his roommate, I talked to him once. He never called me. I called him and it's just been a lot of conflicting stuff. With that, Monica Conyers flew to Houston from Detroit, hoping to figure out what happened. This just means a lot to me. On her finger, a ring that reads mother. It was a gift from Carl. Carl, if something has happened to you and just just come home. I, that's, I just want my son to come home. <laughs> A desperate plea from a mother there. She's also asking anyone who may know anything about Carl's whereabouts to give a call to investigators. We're live tonight from Bush Intercontinental Airport. I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC, Channel 2 News.